So, you want that high quality, blurred out background streamer look, right? But you don't have the budget of most modern day streamers. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how to do it with the phone. Most streamers use something called a DLSR for whenever they record their streams and whatnot. And this is how they get that blurred out background effect like what I'm getting right now because I'm using a Nikon B3200. And this can look really good but it's also very expensive because you need something called a cam link which can go upwards of $200 depending on the model that you get. And you need a camera with an HDMI out. And typically, to get that really blurred out background, an f1.8 lens, which can go for quite expensive. And if you get a crappy one, it doesn't work very well. Alright, anyway, now the setup. So, in order to set this up, you're going to need a phone. Which, I got one here. See? Phone with a good camera. Right? Simple enough. Most people have a phone with a pretty good camera. Also, this will work with any um windows linux and mac it'll work with all three of those and it'll work on android and iphone so you're going to need to go into the app store of your phone you're going to need to go to you need to search you're going to go to irian webcam and then it's going to be the first one that pops up i already have it installed and i've tried droid cam but it, in my opinion it doesn't really work that well but then, so, now uh, you're just going to click install, and then you got to install it on your computer. So you're going to click the link in the description of this video, which down in the description. You might have to click an arrow to get it to expand, but there will be a link to Erian Webcam site where you're going to install it, and then you got to go through the whole installation process of double-clicking the file, accepting the terms and services, and whatnot. But then anyway, let's hop over the computer and I'll show you how to do the rest. In order to get Arian webcam set up, you're going to need to hit Windows or however you launch the application. And then you're going to Arian webcam right there. I also have it over here, but I installed the two camera one just in case I were to connect my tablet or whatever and have it as a second camera. Now if I go to Arian webcam on my phone, just by going, scrolling down, I'm finding it. Yeah, Arian webcam. And then it's going to ask you all this, and then you're just going to click continue. You're going to have to be connected to the same Wi-Fi network as your computer, which this can be done over Ethernet also. It's going to show a preview. There we go. And so now, as you can see, you can create one of these infinite loop things, and it's all wireless. But now in order to get it to 4K, wait, let's just turn it like this. Not like this. Oh, that's a terrible camera angle. Okay, but you see how it's giving me that blurred out background effect, right? The blurred out background really okay a little bit of a crash there but so it's giving me that blurred out background effect and it's default to 1920 by 1080 but you can also crank it all the way up to 4k and then I can actually add it in OBS just by going like this clicking this and then going add a video capture device and then you gotta go down here and just click Arian webcam and then click OK. And then, so now that's added. It's pretty simple to do. Yeah. You can minimize that or whatever. Bruh. There's no good cameras ang camera angles on my desk. Yeah, that's how you get out. That's how you get high quality video for your streams or whatever with your phone let me know if so yeah that's how you get high quality videos for your streams or whatever with your phone 
and you can add it the same way on Discord and whatnot. But anyways, that's going to be the end of this video. Let me know if you enjoyed. See you in the next one, and good. Bye.